Welcome back to the course Scratch Programming for Beginners. Today we'll discuss code block sounds, the sound effect, how to make sounds, and uh, how to uh, increase or decrease the sounds, or how to change the sounds in code block. You need to type the URL scratch.mit.edu on a web browser. Once the browser page is loaded, you need to create start creating button and then the following page will appear on the left hand side under the code you need to click on sound tab and the following uh, code uh, blocks will appear so we'll go uh, in detail each and every code block here is the code editor if you don't know how to open it you can check my other videos in this sound we have uh, play sound mu until done and start sound mu more or less similar but here the mu it will start immediately and play sound that uh, until done that will uh, be paused at that time until it is completed let's go by an example uh, taking an event here and then if i take sound so it plays immediately if i put another sound like that then yeah both are both are if effect at this moment i mean this one is in execution that one is also in execution so if i put let's say uh, this sound mu and then then it will the first line will execute until the mu sound completes it will not go to the second line or the second block so second sound will be played later let's start yeah now it is you are giving uh, you are uh, getting two sounds one after another it's not happening in the start sound okay that is the difference and then stop all sounds that means you are stopping all the sound at the end so that is uh, another block and now you have changed the piece by 10 what does it mean you can change the tone okay of a particular sound or piece by 10 percent is a positive number is uh, 10 percent or you may have 20 30 whatever value you have based on your sound requirement so there is standard documentation in stress you can go through that and similarly set piece to uh, to effect to some uh, initial is 100 percent so initially if you need some tone or piece a particular level let's say 200 in the loud or 2000 loud then you can set it and later you can continue with that so that is one time setup in any of the code block clear on sound effect that is whatever the sound effect you are putting in your code so if you put this block then it will clear at the end when this particular block execute okay and similarly change volume by 10 okay so what does it mean change volume that sound volume will be changed by 10 means 10 percent is negative it will be in the lower side if you put a positive number let's say 10 then it will go to the 10 percent higher side okay and set volume to uh, is similar kind of thing that uh, the piece or set here also your volume initial volume uh, by default is 100 percent whatever the sound is there but you can uh, increase or decrease putting the positive number or negative number okay we learned the different blocks of sound now we will learn uh, how to change the sound and how to record the sound so here if you click on that and if you click on record it will ask you to allow your microphone to record it so you can record the sound in this way if you don't need then you can also import different kind of sounds here the, let's say there are available sounds if you put the cursor yeah yeah based on your filter you can take the animal sound as well 
okay let's say i'm taking this one okay, this sound is added here so if you want to change that particular sound let's say i want to change it to that particular this one and then run okay it's interesting yeah and uh, here if i go to this sound and you can make a copy of that particular sound by clicking here duplicate okay if you want you can export it to a local file system or you can delete it okay and apart from that you can if you want to modify that particular sound let's say i just want to modify and want to delete that okay so then i can use that okay and if i again modify then it's uh, yeah okay and uh, if you want to overlap the another sound in on top of it just copy it and paste it okay it's looking like that yeah and uh, in this way you can modify your sound the way you wish uh, that's all from uh, all the sound effect so in the next video i will create one sample program using the sound thank you for watching stay with me this video is a part of video series based on the topic cast tutorial for the beginner if you like this video then please share like and subscribe the channel thank you